Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. And here we have Mexico against Australia. I'm Peter Drury, and seated in the experts' hot seat is our man Jim Begley. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. So, off we go, then. Vela. It's a loose ball. Vela looks to slip it through and has it out wide now he's left his man gets up to head it it's in there is the breakthrough just so calm under pressure oh this fella's as slippery as a kneel the way he freed himself to score I mean for that defense it was a case of now you've got him now you don't brilliant Mexico take the early advantage. <laughs> Tries a through ball, cut out in the nick of time. <laughs> Dos Santos with the ball through. Where to from here? Vela. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Jedinak. Mexico are already ahead. The perfect start. What a good start to the game. I think their play has been fast and inventive. And, and this is a fine example of early intent. They've begun as they mean to go on. And another goal is on the cards. Mexico are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Has gone out. Going through. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Herrera plays it forward. Vela tries lifting it over. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Jedinak. Mexico scoring in the first ten minutes to give them a 1-0 lead. Into massive leap! He scored! And however many surrounded him, that is what he can do demonstrated great strength there I mean he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away and I think it's just top top play <laughs> Australia grab the equaliser and we're all square Oh, look, Peter, there's a great ebb and flow to this clash, and it's above all expectations for me. Just starting to get the first signs of rain here. Both sides a bit too casual in possession. Robbie Cruz. Must has a pop! It's in! And 
the comeback is complete. High-quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. <laughs> Australia go into the lead. Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend, but now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. It's come loose. And it's Layu. Header! Good delivery, no joy. Jedinak. Looks to clip it forward. Ochoa can claim that. And Freeze had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half time. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. Here we go again, then. Mexico need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Passes it through. Vela looking to get on the end of this. And the shot! That is wayward. Robbie Cruz. He's through and all. He's had a go. He has done it. Two up and threatening to pull clear. That's always a great sight, you know, on a football pitch. Nimble footed, showed great balance and a really cool head to finish. And that kind of dribbling is really smart. Australia take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Look, this position ought to convince them to increase their lead. I think they should uh, be really positive about this now, Peter. Robbie Cruz. Looks like a good ball through. That's offside. Yes, it is. back and it's Cruz forward it goes now it's Vela and the weighted pass Mexico may be thinking about substitutions now they still have two available Then. Out wide to the right. Shots on, big chance, they are rampant, and the lead is extended still further. 
perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. He snaffles his third and that earns him the match ball. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Last one allowed. Mexico opting to make a double change here. Australia grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. Just brushed off the ball there. Now it's Vela. He's got away. Is there any support? He might not need it. Vela. Timely intervention. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Field. Jedinak. Herrera digs one in. Is it in? It's gone a long way up and away. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Australia have plenty in the middle. They've planned to defend the aerial route and will do so with numbers. Shoots! He can pounce on that! Keeper's not concerned by that. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Long and high towards the flank. Shoots! Demanding a quick ball here. is in oh that's a foul in a dangerous area well I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score and obviously he's not going to allow that Peter is he he's gone for goal And it's Cruz. Hoists it high. Well read, he sorted that out. He's on his way. Now the pass. Vela. He's gone for it! And that may well be that. That is that. Quite a game. Memorable for its fluctuation in fortunes. An astonishing turnaround. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Mexico really were sleepwalking in central defence, and the alarm just never went off.